hello dear students in this video you will study about matrices we are going to start from basic definition matrix is basically a rectangular arrangement of numbers or alphabets or um, any entry for example if we have four numbers one five six one this is a rectangular arrangement of uh, four numbers one five six and one four entries so this this is called matrix sometimes we will have a matrix in which we have equal rows and equal columns that type of matrix is called square matrix for example in this matrix we have two rows this is row and we have two columns so this type of matrix is called a square matrix the order of a matrix is called number of rows cross number of columns. For example, in this matrix, we have two rows and two columns. So, order of this matrix will be 2 multiplied by 2. Similarly, if we talk about this matrix, 1, 2. In this matrix, we have two rows. This is first row, this is second row, and this is one column. So, we have two rows and one column. Order of this matrix will be 2 cross 1. And if we talk about this matrix, 1, 3, 5, we have just one row multiply by we have three columns this is first column this is second column and this is third column so order of this matrix will be one cross three so number of rows multiplied by number of columns is called order of matrix we will start from addition of a matrix if you have two matrices one zero five one plus 2, 1, 6, 7. If we need to add these two matrices. Now, corresponding entries will be added into corresponding entries. For example, the uh, corresponding entry of 1 in this matrix is 2. Similarly, the corresponding entry of uh, this one in this matrix is 7. So, 1 will be added into that will become 1 plus 2. It will be equal to 3 and 0 plus 1. 1, 5 plus 6, uh, 11 and 1 plus 7 that will become 8 but if we need to subtract these two matrices if we need to subtract these two matrices we will have 1 minus 2 that will be equal to minus 1 0 minus 1 again minus 1 5 minus 6 minus 1 and 1 minus 7 that will be equal to minus 6 so it's all about the addition or subtraction of matrices up next we have scalar multiplication if we multiply any number with a matrix, that number will be multiplied with all entries of a matrix. For example, we are going to multiply this matrix with 7. Now, this, this number will be multiplied with all entries of this matrix. So, we will have 7 into 5, 35, 7 into 1, 7, 7, 6 are 42, and 7, 3 are 21. And let me tell you one thing that in case of addition or subtraction order of two or more than two matrices must be equal if order of two matrices are not equal you cannot add or you cannot subtract both matrices for example if you have two matrix matrices one zero five one and one three these are two matrices now we can see that order of this matrix is two by two and order of this matrix is two by one this order is not equal so we cannot add or subtract these two matrices so for, audition, for addition or subtraction, orders of two matrices must be equal. Now we will solve an example, a simple example. Let's suppose if we have a matrix 1, 0, 3, 7 and this is a matrix minus 1, 0, 3, 1 and we need to find 3a plus 2b. This will be equal to 3 multiplied by A. A is 1, 0, 3, 7 plus 2 into B. This is minus 1, 0, 3 and 1. So we will have 3 into 3, 3 into 1, 3, 0, 3, 3 is our 9 and 3, 7 is our 27 plus minus 2, 0, 6 and 2. So at the end we will have uh, 3 plus minus minus 3 minus 2 will be 1 and 0 plus 0 0 9 plus 6 15 and 27 plus 2 will be equal to 29. This will be the matrix for 3a plus 2b. 
now we will see that how two matrices can be multiplied But there is a condition for multiplication of matrices we have done with addition or subtraction of matrices like in addition or subtraction we have a condition that uh, order of matrices must be same similarly we have a condition in case of uh, multiplication of two matrices and the condition is for example we have two matrices one three and two zero one five if we need to multiply these two matrices, the order of this matrix is 2 cross 1 and order of this matrix is 2 cross 2. We will write orders of both matrices and we will see if we if these two numbers that we have in middle are equal or not. If, do, if these two numbers are equal, the, mat, the multiplication of matrices is possible. But if these two numbers are not equal, like in this case, the multiplication is impossible. It means that the number of columns in first matrix, number of columns in first matrix must be equal to the number of matrix, number of rows in second column, number of rows in second column. If this condition is satisfied, the multiplication of matrices is possible. But look at this condition. We cannot multiply these two matrices over here. So we will solve another example. If we multiply these two matrices 1, 0, 3, 1 with 2, 1, 5, 3. Now we will start with first row first of all this row is multiplied with both columns first of all we will multiply this row with both columns and there is a method that if you multiply a row with a column this is a row and this is the column left element of row is multiplied with upper element of this column and similarly right element of the row is multiplied with lower element of column so we'll have one multiply by 5 plus 3 multiply by 1 in this way we will multiply these rows with these columns this is multiplication of matrices so if we multiply this row with this column we know that left element is multiplied with upper element of column and right element of row is multiplied with lower element of this column so we'll have 1 multiply by 2 plus 0 multiply by 5. We can see that we have multiplied this row with this column. Now we will multiply this row with this column. In the same way, we will multiply left element with upper element and right element with lower element. So we will have 1 multiply by 1 plus 0 multiply by 3. Now in upper row, we have multiplied this upper row with both columns. Now in lower row, we will multiply this lower row with both columns using same method. So 3 multiplied by 2 plus 1 multiplied by 5. And here 3 multiplied by 1 plus 1 multiplied by 3. So we will have here 2 and 1. 3 2s are 6, 6 plus 5, 11. And here 3 plus 3. 6 so this is basically multiplication of both matrices and uh, we can check if our answer is correct or incorrect the order of this matrix was 2 by 2 and similarly order of this matrix was 2 by 2 our answer should be 2 the order of our answer must be 2 cross 2 now look at in this example we need to multiply these two matrices and if you multiply these two matrices we need to see if there is possibility or not the order of this matrix is 2 cross 2 and order of this matrix is 2 cross 1 now we can see that that these two numbers are matching so multiplication is possible here so we will start multiplication 
we will multiply this row with this column 1 multiply by 1 this is 1 plus 0 multiply by 3 now we have second and fourth identity in this matrix but in this example in second matrix we have just one column so we will finish it over here so that will become 5 multiplied by 1 plus 1 multiplied by 3 we will have 1 and 5 into 1 fun, uh, 5 5 into 1 5 5 plus 3 8 again we can see that the order of resultant matrix is to cross 1 we can verify this so this was multiplication of uh, matrices